<laughs> okay. Hi, I'm Dr. Courtright, and we are coming to you from Alicia Pet Care Center. Today, we are placing a Freestyle Libre on our little patient, Sadie. A couple things come in this pack, and that's something that we do apply here in hospital. We have already shaved the site for her, so we just clip it down with some clippers, and then we're going to scrub the area with alcohol. So once the area is clean, that's when we will go ahead and start applying the sensor. This is what the sensor looks like. It's just a very small needle in here. Prior to applying it, we are going to put some skin glue on just so it stays onto the patient. Then all we have to do is just press down. And then we just let that stick for about 30 to 45 seconds before removing it. All right, and then when it's already nice and adhered, then we just peel this portion up and then that's the sensor that remains. So this is what's gonna stay on the pet for 14 days. The benefit of doing the Freestyle Libre is that we get 14 days of continuous blood glucose readings, whereas if we did it in hospital, we would really only be getting about 12, 12 hours maximum. And then on top of the sensor, we do place a small piece of tape just to make sure that they're not able to peel it up at all. You look beautiful. Yay. Yay! And then we're just gonna put this on top of you to protect the sensor even one more layer. The biggest issue that we see with the sensors is if they scratch them off. But since we've been putting the tape on top and then this little t-shirt, we really haven't had any issues and they've been keeping them on for a majority 14 days or so. Prior to this appointment, you are going to get an email with step-by-step -step instructions on how to download the app. If you can try to have that done ahead of time, it's really gonna help us out to make sure that the appointment runs smoothly. So this is the app that you're going to download. It's yellow and it says Libre Link. There are a couple different ones, so you wanna make sure this is the correct one. Once you click it, you're gonna see that the sensor looks like the sensor that we placed. Get started now. It's gonna say that your country has been identified as the United States. Click next, accept. So then you're gonna put in the patient's first name, last name, and birth date. If your pet is younger than 18 years old, which most pets are, you will also have to input your information, but that's okay because you are obviously the one controlling the app. So once you um, make your account, and the most important thing to keep in mind is that you have to make sure that the email that you make for this account has to match the email that you have provided us in the past, because that is how we are going to link your account to the Alicia Pet Care account. So once you've signed in, it will give you a unit of measurements. So you're gonna keep it as this, that's your only option. So then you're going to set your units to 100 to 150. And then we're not going to be using the carbs, so you can just hit grams. And then it will say welcome, next, and then it just goes through step by step how you're going to monitor. The biggest concern for us is going to be if we're seeing any blood glucose below about 70 or 80, that's when you should be notifying us. And then you're just going to hit next, 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 until you get to this image. You wanna hit allow for notifications. And as you can see in the photo, it's showing the sensor. This is showing it on a person. This is going to be the most important area where you're going to hit scan new sensor and then your screen should show you ready to scan. This is when you're going to hold your phone near the top of the sensor in order to get a reading. And when we first place the monitor, so we just placed this one less than 10 minutes ago, you're gonna see that it has a 60 minute lag time on the screen, so that's normal. So the first reading will not be able to come in until an hour after placement. So as long as you see this yellow screen, then you know that you're in the clear. So cute. For Miss Sadie here, she has diabetes and about every six months, we wanna be checking on her glucose levels and making sure her insulin is at an appropriate level. One of the other benefits of having the Freestyle Libre monitor in place is that traditionally with the blood glucose curve, we're having to poke the patients once every hour in order to get a blood sample. With the monitor, it's continuously reading and we're not having to poke them. They're not having to spend the entire day here. So it's something that their families can check for them at home.